my imperfections are evident. I stand as a faulty man. I'm dressed in sin, but a touch of your garment brings healing. I'm going to start with like the most random question. Uh, yeah. But I, I really, this has been bothering me for years, man. I'm a curious guy. Yeah. And um, I, I believe that like male musicians wear sunglasses more than any demographic on planet Earth, yeah. especially when they go to interviews. Yeah. Is this like a rule? Like when you get into the industry, does someone take you beside and they're like, Sha, sunglasses go interview. Is that a thing? It is, actually. <laughs> <laughs> so for most people, when, when you're an artist, you're advised to build this persona yeah. around you, right? Where there's Brian K and there's Brian Kadengu. Yeah. And I, I did that for, for a while, where at some point I even had dreadlocks up to here. I will wear three, four glasses. Yeah. Um, up, 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 up. <laughs> um, and then I got to a point where I realized that if I went into a space and I didn't have those things, I wouldn't be confident in who I am. I would yeah. feel like, ah, bane, bane is so, so, yeah, it's, it's a, it's a, it's, it's a, a thing. thing. It's a thing. It's good to hear that, man. I thought I was crazy. <laughs> I, I kept noticing it. I was like, it's a man, thing. Like, what is, what is in the eyes that we're not supposed to see? Also, most artists spend a lot of time alone in the studio. Or with people they're comfortable with. Yeah. Right? You're working and when you're on stage, it's usually you're here, the crowd is there. There's a distance, right? So you're 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 putting up an act. So you're performing. When you're done, take a few pictures and leave. Back to like circle. To your comfort yeah. zone. Yeah. You know, so kuya munas don't have my glasses, names if you long and ruku druku pins I'm cutting also fun up here. Because, yeah. you know, my sister and daughter and daughter are going. That's true as well. Yeah. That's true. Like, you can tell if someone is, like, is lying or something just through their eyes. Yeah. It, it, there's a thing. Yeah. I love that, man. And I appreciate that you don't have them on right now. Because <laughs> 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 I, I, I actually... <laughs> no. When I actually yeah. scripted this, yeah. I, I thought that you would be wearing it. <laughs> Great. Great. So, so it's a good thing. I'm not, I'm not yeah, yeah, as predictable. It's, 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 <laughs> a, it's an extra layer. It's yeah. an extra layer. I love that, man. I really yeah. do love that. But um, in, in giving me that answer, you referenced a couple of things. You referenced um, Brian K and Brian Kadiangu and there being a difference. And in a previous interview, you said something that uh, really struck me. Um, you said uh, during the time that you were being mentored, for lack of a better term, yeah. by the late uh, Dr. Olivam Tukuzi, mm -hmm. one of the things he said to you was, <clears throat> you're not giving people uh, the Brian from Chinoy. Yeah. Uh, and this is something that he repeatedly said to you. Yeah. Um, what did he mean by this, first of all? And then what did it take for you to realize this? by yourself so it, it took me time to really get it yeah you know how these these guys on the industry they've seen a lot of things especially for for someone like dr Olivam yeah. Tukuzi. <laughs> he had been in the industry for for like but 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 <laughs> you know so at first, when he would say that, when I when I started to know him, I did Afro jazz, yeah. right? When I won Star Bright, I was supposed to record an album with him, so that's sort of where our relationship started, yeah. right? I wanted to do Afro jazz because tell me, Ajo, no ah no, but no music, he doesn't. Yeah, that's what you can you know, see. And I'm thinking, okay, if I'm going to be mentored by someone like him, I need to have a sound that's close to what he does. Yeah. So that at least he will have a better him, appreciation. Mdara yeah. Tuku understood me music. Sometimes you'll get into his office and you'll be listening to music. You understand about ah. 
like triple play <laughs> with the kind of person he was you would expect but ah but man this man dara dara but i know this is the protein so i did that album right yeah played it for him but uh, yeah it's, it's okay but we are sitting here brain of you know yeah as brain of you know and down this other out the shindaka tota am dara kama arungo hater arungo arungo what the other nduguru wa sound ya gisa ka i didn't get it yeah so i didn't get it and i got okay boom fast forward i think like a year two years later yeah. right i did a song called ndoita say ndoita say in auto tune and i'm starting to experiment because before i never used to like having auto tune put on my vocal cuz yeah. like no I'm a great vocalist, I'm a great singer. I don't need I'm a purist. Yeah. It has to yeah, be. Yeah, I think I'm sure we're going to do it. Yeah. It has to be. But then also sound by nge chivo, but things change. Like sonically, pane music by nge chivo, yenda yenda kwa kasi yana kwa kuti sometimes pane sound ye kuti in certain spaces I feel. So, with Doita said like, okay, let me experiment. We can eat data, you know, got also to the car auto be chana. It's a bit it and was after after heavy machine. Right? Then I played it for him. But I played it for him, he don't ah nasa the chance ma. Those are cool I don't it ah. I played it for him, listen to it. Pedro Gonzalez, thank you. Thank you for listening. Oh, you dear brain of Noyo. I was like that confusion because I was like this is not what I was expecting this is not the response I was I was expecting again I still didn't get it ibabo because I don't know okay bo kana mati bo ndizo zo but so zaka ita is zaka ndipa confidence zikuna manje experiment yeah more because like okay if he's saying this is me and this is something that I tend to see experimenter like you didn't think this is this. you at the time yeah because uh, i just done it but okay i think it's a nice vibe they can do it as a great as onya kadai so for radio cuz radio plays that kind of music yeah. you know when you make song ya kadai so you know when our song will play out because ndo she got on the high so soon they sound they do ni zvatu naita hatiridze at that time now obviously radio has evolved um wa wito wachi wa open to to more genres and yeah, more they, it's yeah. not as strict yeah so at certain so she ka zvino but at least to go we we getting there. on that path yeah so it it did that for me yeah i love that man and and so you touched on like two important things Um we're going to come back to like radio and curation. Uh-huh. Uh but Starbright <clears throat> you want Starbright in 2012 if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. I was watching that and I was like yo this is this is crazy. Uh 10 years. Yep. 11 now like we're going into the 11th year. Yeah. Um competitions like that is is Starbright still going on? I'd like to It is. It is right. Um, It is. What uh what lessons about music and the industry did you take from that experience that you might not have had if it wasn't for Starbright and this is before you winning and then getting like the contract and going yeah. to work with uh, Anna Tuku and all that yeah so they will do a lot of crazy things things i thought were unnecessary at the time was that what happened guys to do my guitar and when i'm get chingo yemba so like this one time we went to we'll do my boot camps i yeah. And my gonna go phone her and I'm going to say around 4 a.m. or 3. Yeah. So mo guy, mo to no eta audition. Tell me as you shout. But I know mo ga o ga no no ka. Time that you just by to call at here with we are 5 minutes. O ga no no ka. Wa to in so go in mad pool. So mo go need so you know you know what people do yeah. when they're doing yeah. like, my team building and shit. At the time, they thought, but this is very But next sada ku end this work mad pool. Ne go to say saying I would make sure that kitongo shedzwa umu au funge. 
Sukan awak cina orang orang kan? Orang orang tu orang Asia tu baru tu sebab orang tu orang okay. Dua orang tu. Masih nak orang dia? Eh, masih nak orang dia. Orang tu muda, orang tu bayar, and you sing. Ten million solutions you see later. That's why I want to okay. As an artist, sometimes you get a show, yeah. right? And you're told you're performing at 11 p.m. Yeah. Show your tanga at 11 p.m. But I don't know. Pump weight as much. He says when you end up having to go on stage, you can have my two, you can have yeah. my three. So when I then got into the industry, that an active player in the industry. Because there's some people who say, I can't sing after this time. Yeah. Or Maxine, ah, can't sing over Muga and can't sing. That has never been because I then trained myself. Let it sing, and she move out, make myself go through. Could voice around or even eat. You can't just know and don't eat this because it's bad for your vocal. Mm-hmm. Like okay, I'm gonna yeah. eat that because I need to train it. Could the result and my conditions you like I just say can I am wear graphs to be the same to get a graph so that and also something as simple as being on time you know it's something that a lot of people could know who we don't sometimes we don't take it serious yep. right as, especially in in our industry <laughs> as artists as, as musicians because things are too ah and yeah. but when you do business with people when ngwari mu mu mamwe mama sekta akasiana siana you then see the importance of that when you go out there uno boss uno do okay she do jaza she do kuno kuno nza azo shika an hour later azo cuz you know for you yeah so you know it's it's something that's so simple she kuti munhu pamuno fanwa ngo chitoziva but time yacho yo 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 pataito zvidzidzwa naito ta but later it was announced that this was a valuable lesson. Yeah. Then it's like we did the early stage, because my habits, yeah. right? Yeah. Once you start doing, you know, and you get used to doing things in a certain way, you get used to being late. And when I was out, I was like, but that is what I don't know. I just go good. I want my shit come down. I'm like, yeah. so you don't really get to. It's difficult to learn some lessons once you're already in the industry. Operating because one one language is really like like yeah, and I suppose it happens as well with you. <laughs> yeah, people do get like starstruck, isn't it? Like yeah, and the people are there for you anyway. Um, yeah, and and sometimes that can almost like warp um, the boundaries that should be there. But you should respect your craft, and we showed up. Yeah, maybe you should also like show up uh, in, in in good time. Yeah. Right? That always gets lost. I, I see that being a very complicated um, relationship yeah. between like fans and uh, the artist. But coming back to radio, because I didn't script this and I think I might forget this. <laughs> uh, you talked about curation of, of, of radio, right? Mm-hmm. Um, you started working in music uh, around like 2012 professionally. Yeah. Uh, you had experience like prior to that, but uh, Starbright is then what really like launched you into the industry. Yep. Um, what are you seeing that's different about uh, radio from 2012 up until now? So there's <laughs> good. Punishment is really Yeah. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, but then Let's again, both of it, I it's it's. Muno <laughs> is it didn't get to the entitled to my to my opinions they do, yeah. right? So, um, before radio used to, and I think now they've started doing it again. Actually, used to you you would hear a song on radio, yeah. First, why play again? And let the fans decide. Yeah. I'm not saying there's anything wrong. Now we've, we've come to a point where we have personalities. So <laughs> if the DJ doesn't like the song, if I give you my song and you, I, I feed it to personal taste, yeah. you play the song, you rate it. Already 
Uruguto. Or pleasure something. Yeah. Subconsciously. Okay, yeah. Ah, you know what? For me, I don't like it. I'll give it a yeah. two. Not even subconsciously. Consciously, actually. You've placed yeah. something too. So, for people, because you're someone, I want to tell you that you're someone they like, this is how we are as human beings, right? This is Doja yeah. Neta. If someone I like says something, I'm probably going to. You know, so <laughs> it's, 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 it's one of the things that I, that I think, I mean, it's, it's entertainment, yeah. right? For you, it's, it's, it's great. You get to feel important because you've said what you think yeah. and you've said, okay, I don't think this is going to do well because. But, you know, this artist has spent a lot of time in the studio working on Girgini. That's something that I think you would work better if you were to just play it. Tell us what you think. Yeah. yeah. If oh, you have any opinion now, now, call the artist. Yo. I think for some it's so 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 maybe yeah. when you work on your next song, work on this, it has shagat, 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 shagat. Tabu wakana. We're building the industry. Yeah. Um because some people I, for example in any, I don't care what anyone says, I believe in myself so much. Yeah. Okay, this is what I was put on this earth for. To make music. Yeah. And everything I touch is gold. And it's yeah. more than I doubt in Israel. But there are other people we're putting because artists are very sensitive. I used to be like that. Yeah. But over the years, you know it was developed by she Yeah, so I would imagine for someone who's starting, right? And they sometimes it's even hard for people to put themselves out there to say, okay, that no Buddha, um you know, I'm putting the music. You on. do that, and <laughs> so um, that I think it is something to go to. Yeah, it's not necessary. Yeah. For industry, for is it is it? You go build there, right? Can I go to there? So or also, professionalism, right? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> and you know, radio has also played a big role in in supporting one of the biggest. Genres in Zimbabwe, which is Zim Dancehall, yeah. right? Zim Dancehall, and over the past few years, Zim Hip Hop, Yanga Yich, Iri, Iri, Iri on the rise. I think they, they they did a great job with that. They're doing a great job with that. But to now, it's time to push them because I think their genres, a good team, they can really open doors. For, for us as an industry. For example, R&B. Yeah. I really think we don't have a lot of R&B music playing yeah, on, yeah. on the radio. There are a few names that... Yeah. yeah, but there's lots of amazing R&B artists out there. We could see if they were given an opportunity to, okay, because um, people listen to radio anyway. You know, it's... I know people, you know, they think, no, we have to put music at that, so by the time it goes on, that would die. One can watch the music, a party, a chichi, and my platforms are one day when they're bad. Yeah. Radio, no believe what you're not get it balanced. Could okay, you, yeah, so they're giving you a piece of everything. Everything, right? As so, much as they, they can. Yeah, so that everyone has an opportunity. Because my platforms are good thing. Do, do, bass around. Yeah. Passing my guitar, panning a bass door in a good thing. So, but then conversation, you're it, 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 very tricky. In what way? <laughs> it, 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 it's tricky. Because then, again, no one owes anyone anything. Okay, yeah. I know no. that, I understand that. It's so, different for, 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 for a national radio station. For national radio stations, yeah. we could say, yeah. but for most of the radio stations we have, a private owned radio stations. So you can't really yeah. go and say, hey, well, but guys, <laughs> you have to support But you know, the digital is and you as an artist, as someone who's been in the industry, as someone who listens to radio, yeah. you really see good okay. Especially now, it's uh more kungema tabloids, Nijo. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I, Where we're looking for the training stories, we're looking for easy, 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 easy. <laughs> it's, it's brilliant that you say that. I, 
I was saying this I think a couple of weeks ago, a month ago, um, and I'll redact the name of the radio station because... Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, <clears throat> you, you open radio uh, and most of the times that I listen to radio is, is school run time when I'm taking my, my sister to uni. Yeah. I'm dropping her off. And they're talking about, um, like, it seems like the, the biggest source of news for them is Zim Celebs. That's where they get yeah. whatever it is they talk about. And Zim Celebs is like a tablet, right? And I don't knock them. Uh, they do, like, great work in their field. But it's like, is everything entertaining? Is everything like scandalous? Is everything sensational? Do you use the actual here? Is that like the whole spectrum? Of yeah. And we, we, we have to be careful about the message we're sending out there. Yeah. Because, for example, your sister, right? Yeah. We don't know, maybe when she finishes school, she, want, she would want to get into the entertainment industry. Right, be a singer or an actor or whatever, an actress or whatever. Right, true to me, that message if you want to be noticed, yeah. you have to do something scandalous, a bit crazy, a bit crazy. But on the side, it's it actually you want to pay attention. It's 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 scary, man, because yeah. that's not that's not how we should we should be moving that's not where we should be going yeah. as as it goes against everything we, we we represent as as a people as african people yeah even that's not who we are that's not how we <laughs> <do>. <laughs> yeah. unfortunately we are choosing to copy yeah. <laughs> so it's it's a very it's a tricky conversation, yeah. is how I would put it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's very tricky. Yeah. Why I say that is because... Um, why I say that is because anytime you then um, speak um, against that, it then seems... Um, it then seems like you are... You're labeled a hater. Uh, maybe that's one yeah. of the things uh, you're labeled as, as a person who's maybe too uptight. Yeah, like you're too serious. Like on our own, like you know, and, and it's like I don't know, man. It... Yeah, but then again, look, um, we don't always have as much time as we think we do. Yeah, yeah. Right. When when you're starting, True. for example, for me, when I was starting out in in music, right. So. When I say this, I'm not saying ah, nah, to only mask yeah. But I mean, you every do have year. ten years in the game. Man. I do. I think every year. The right to speak. Yeah, <laughs> every year I give myself a new project. So when I start working on that, I start working on it yeah. as if I'm a new artist. So one day you mentioned, okay, this is <laughs> something new. So I have to excitement and then I you ten years ago. But I, but I got when I just start, right? Yeah. They, I'm always looking to find okay. Ikako. Um, so, as as Munu and Kuti, Unuwan or Kangua, which is a Nigrikini, you get times that Kutu Nonzi, okay, when you go on interviews, don't talk about this, don't say this, don't, don't, yeah. don't, yeah. don't, 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 don't. Need training. Okay. And then you look at all these things. What does he really care about? Yeah. You see, most of what I'm being told not to talk about <laughs> is, is what I'm supposed to be talking about. Right? Because <laughs> if everyone does the same thing, Tesla can go follow out, okay, this is really what's like a Twitter battle. Who is going to be there? To be an example, okay, you can actually set up your career in this way. Yeah. As long as you put in the work, as long as you show up and do what you need to do, what's supposed to happen will happen. Yeah. That day, we pass it now. If you put in work, you get you results. Abana, abana, So, yeah. 
you know, if, if there's anything that I've learned, pa pa pa, gorero no orisha, sila dalto mozigera mashuro. Recently, we lost my ma- mom, ma- two great artists, African artists, right, Ooh, yeah. from South Africa. Okay, young Costa. guys. Yeah. Costas like twenty what seven? Young guys, super young. I get it. Tim the good thing about age. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to talk to them. But so that the you know yes they've done great things, but they still had a lot more to give. So now if if I have said to myself. There's things I believe in. There's things I don't subscribe to. Yeah. Right? I'm not I'm not there. In India said that party angu kutaora. Zvinenge zviri pamoyo pangu neku po perspective yangu on my tikurani ngachiita zvino. Then ndinenge ndisiri ku ita zvandu kufanana ngachiita vasivana. Yeah. So kakawanda kacho zvinotozo lida kuzvino zvakawanda wanda vamtozoita depression wangu daisa because you're not expressing yourself yeah. in the way that you want to so you need to come back to that calling yeah 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 i hear that i hear that but uh calling is an interesting one um and you seem to keep coming back to calling yeah um why is it for you like such an important thing to do what you're called to do <laughs> and not run away from that cuz then if 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 you you run away from it i don't think you can Same here. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but if you, you if you cuz running away from it mean, means you're dead yeah right as long as you're here and you're not doing what you were put on this earth for you will never really find joy peace as well and peace <laughs> right there's a lot of things you would see and i'm not an expert on calling or just like that okay so let me break it down <laughs> no but i know for for myself yeah. right it's something that i've known from a very very young age i loved music i loved the jackson 5 i Look at myself in the mirror and dream and it was on and I got fun and I'm a good ex and I did I didn't find I Loved music Right now, it's cool. Don't see so what do you want to be? Yeah, I'm wondering the door a doctor was a doubt the music music, you know, so <laughs> High school I remember my history teacher mm. and the mr. Manera I got one that I don't know how to say that. 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 I don't know I'm going to dedicate my life to making sure do not have to my guitar I respect. Yeah. What does that mean? It means I'll have to live my life in a certain way. I'll have to do certain things to to move in a certain way. You go to Moana and Agumba. I cannot I want to be like Brian. Bere cannot have so to ah, I can go to a twist 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 so shy I cannot want to do anything. Okay. Jiri <laughs> Yeah. You know, because Gudara with with most artists, what will happen is my label. I never sing a doctor and wah, fungi se jaga wand. So talk about my studio, talk about my studio, talk about my baby, talk about my drugs, talk about Doro. Eh, mo karamu epi. I'm just fungi se jaga wand. You're not asking too many questions. You're not asking too many questions. Marie Jane Epi, on Murungu, Rama, Kalu Kalu, Bika Kau, Nasa, Ita, Ish, Nish, 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 Mangwa, Nasa, Ita, Ita, Ish, Nish, Nish, Nish. So, I don't blame people who say, "Ah, my guitar is dead, 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 dead." This also, but true it as such, I can't say it again. Could it be changed? So that we make the world a better place, because when I pass it on, my guitar is passing a good respect to my artists. To know what I'm batting for, if I'm. And I believe music 
the entertainment industry has potential to actually change in a way. Change, yeah. change, change, change. Yeah. So, yeah. I hear that. I hear that. It's a shared belief. Um, I think we, <clears throat> we turn our back on, on things that could save us because, you know, like uh, these, these notions or these things that we've been taught and we refuse to question them, right? Um, yeah. But you said an important thing before actually getting into calling. You talked about <clears throat> remaining excited within your work, um, always looking to challenge yourself, always looking to experiment. And um, yeah. so we're going to touch on what you're working to give us, which is like a new sound. But in line with this as well, um, I, I wanted to talk to you about your your chemistry, your relationship, uh, your musical relationship with, with Tanto Wavy. Um, yeah. First I heard um, Kananda Shrika. Yeah. Off of Tanto's album. I was like, man, this is crazy. It's just, yeah. I remember listening to it for the first time and, and, and telling my older brother, I'm like, Iro Iro Gitari Iro Derimun Wan. Yeah. In Zimbabwe. <laughs> uh, and Brian K. And I went into groups and said this uh, without knowing for a fact. Uh, yeah. I, it was just a hunch. Is that yeah. true? Yeah. Fantastic. I'll, I'll go back <laughs> and, and tell these people again that I, I was right. Yeah. <laughs> but, um, and then you did the, the more recent one. Um, I'm forgetting the name. Soma. Soma. Yeah. The one that you put the video out for. And, and when that dropped, the. The thing that then came to me was, and I tweeted this out, I was like, um, I, I didn't believe, I had no idea that the only thing missing from my life was like a, a joint EP from uh, Tanto and Brian K. Yeah. Because everything you touch is, is gold. Yeah. How did you guys start collaborating and why is it like everything that you make together is just like otherworldly? Tanto is a brilliant artist, man. Mm -hmm. he's, he's, he's a blessing. To this, to this country, <laughs> I, mean, um, I, I, I really sense. wish more people would give his music time, right? And really, he's, he's, he's insanely talented. Mm. And, and I love working with, I, I only work with people who I, who I admire. Okay. So he's an artist I admire. I look at him like, okay, this dude is. This is Smart. <laughs> he's he's a great artist. I'd love to to work with him. So um, how we started working? That's what you asked, yeah. right? How we got together? He called me, sent me a message actually, mm -hmm. and he wanted me to do guitars on some of his songs. So his other guitars, he actually plays them himself. Oh, for real? On his other songs, yeah. Ananam, DPC, like my my song, I get my and he does his guitars himself. So um, he's brilliant with that. And then you wanted something different. You wanted affiliate in Grikini. Hit me up, bro. Um, can I, once on this one, my guitar, oh, send them yeah. through. Send Let's them, did the guitar. So we started, we did that for a while, where when he had stuff, he will send them to me. And then I wrote a song. It's not out yet, actually. The first song we actually, Work work. <laughs> yeah, it's coming out on the album that's coming. So I did this song and I've always wanted to, I've always experimented, right? Mixed different styles of music. Um, when the Torah trade, if you've heard songs like Tunga Mirai, yeah. uh, you know, I always like to, to fuse Jin. So I made a song in the Dark Trade, uh, Sungura and like, but experimenting with a lot of synth things, right? So I did the song, wrote the song, finished it. Song at the and I was gonna sing it, right? Record it. But Nati, but wait, I know someone who's already on this mixed sungura thing, yeah. this wave. I know someone who's who would be perfect for this. Why? Why do I want to sing it? So let me just do the chorus. Let me call him to come and do the first part. So I called him. Yo, got this song. So 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 so. She came to the studio. Came through. Yeah. We worked on it. I think we spent the, the, the whole night. Worked on it, recorded it. Um, and then after that, I was like, yo, I'm working on my album and would love for you to, to, be, to be on it. Yeah. Yeah. So, and then the song, I got da 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 da. Oh, come through. Came to the studio again. 
we worked on on his song. That's when we did. Um, actually, no, we worked on Tomwa. Oh, so Tomwa was first. Uh, yeah. Before. Before. Before on that shit. Yeah. We did Tomwa. Um, so on Tomwa, I wanted to have either Toki vibes or Tanto Wavy. Yeah. Um, and I was like, okay, Tanto is. You're here. <laughs> this is my guy. Uh, yo, again, there's, there's another song. Come through, he came through, we did that. And then he's like, bro, I'm releasing my album. And I've got a song that I want to, to have you on. Cool. Came through, chopped it up. And he's, he's, he's a brilliant artist. It's easy when, when, when you work with people who actually know what they're, they're doing. Yeah. Right? It's difficult to yeah. not be in that name. And, I, and I'm big on energy right because music i respect music so much i love it so much yeah. bro don't do i i respect my guitar yeah. Yeah. if i get into a space and i'm working with someone and paita something chingori or because then it's it's not coming from a place of love right yeah. music should always come from from love it should always come from respect it should always come from spacey pure so with tanto i think we we had that we we when we were making these 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 songs the energy was pure you know we and whenever i, I pitched the songs to him he loved them like bro this is yeah. great got to do got to do it so it was it was very easy I it's love very easy, that, man. I love, and so you guys, essentially, what you've done is everything you recorded, Makazi Budita in reverse. Like, yeah, the first song is coming out last on the yeah. next project, and <laughs> yeah, okay, yeah. fair enough, fair enough. Um, speaking of new project, uh -huh. uh, new challenges, new new territory. I mean, uh, you hit me up. You told me I've got a gospel album on the way. Yeah, I was like, what? This is okay. Yeah. <laughs> I, yeah. I know you've done uh, a gospel song before. Uh, I've done gospel songs. Oh, for real? I, I only know of one. I think my love is... My love. I... Shaina Kungezua. Uh, the, the one with, 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 with Kruger. It's gospel that's as well. Gospel. Yeah. yeah, that's gospel. That, yeah. That's more recent, actually. That's yeah. gospel. Uh, yeah, so... Fair enough. Fair enough. Yeah. But... That's the next phase. Um, that's interesting in a, for a number of reasons. Uh, for the longest of times, the impression that people have had is uh, Brian K. I know you've been my baby. Um, yeah. Uh, Brian K. loves these women. Um, and it's a true impression, I think. Yeah, it is. fair, right? It is. <laughs> and so, what, what made you want to take on the challenge of a gospel album and I, and I know an album is important as well because um, usually albums signal like more commitment you recently did yeah. Honey on Ice uh, the EP yeah um, but now it's, it's it's a gospel album yeah uh, why did you want to move in this direction now I I have always wanted to I've always loved gospel music you know, when I when I met my lowest, yeah. that's what I listen to, right? When I'm going through things, when I'm not sure about things, yeah. that's what I listen to to get myself back in the in the groove. Yeah. So I've always wanted to to make music that that's like that, right? Everyone who knows me, everyone yeah. who knew me from from Chinoy, um, when I started doing music professionally, right, everyone thought I, I would do gospel music. Okay. Because I don't know. For a lot of musicians, that's where we start, yeah. right? And I made a conscious decision to say, okay, I'm not going to do gospel music because I'm young. Yeah. I still want to explore a lot of genres. Yeah. I don't want to say, okay, I'm doing this now, and then because you know how for 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 a lot of people, when you say you're a gospel artist, you people can't. expect <laughs> expect you to move in a certain way, yeah. right? Yeah. 
But people also forget that we're human. Yeah. I'm a human being. The moon, the child, go through the moon, the child, the child, the man, the right? It's normal. Yeah. But and, man, and, and confirm. Maybe this is unfair, and and I'm sorry to cut you off. Um, yeah. A gospel artist, for some reason, is not allowed to make heavy machine. He's not allowed to make two yeah. more. Like punted like an apple with yeah. the. Yeah. ตัวโพสิทีฟอีทิงอ่ะอ่ะคือบอกว่าเลมิสิคอนเทนต์เค้าเลยเค้าเลยเซอร์คิลเลอร์เอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่
you realize in that moment because you're saying, no, I'm an artist. Yeah. This is what an artist does. That, that right? tends to happen <laughs> to artists a lot. Yeah. So, <laughs> and you tend to get a pass for it as well, right? Because yeah. People have kind of normalized it. Yeah. So I was like, no. Let me take two, three steps back. But again, it's all mira. Because. this is why you disappeared last year. Because yeah. after Care Package, after around, I think April. Yeah. Kind of so for May, I. And it was extreme. I cut my hair. I had locks. Yeah. And I don't know. Yeah. I like a reset. Yeah, good to okay. If this is what this is making me feel, like I was saying, I love music so much. Right? And he, the moment I don't turn around, I feel long in music, yeah, because music has never let me down. Yeah. It's been the one consistent thing in my life, man. Right? God. Yeah. Music. In, in that order, <laughs> right? <laughs> so, the moment I don't talk about feeling, ah, but music, I just don't pass through, it's not the music. Yeah. There's something, something wrong with in the English and Drugit. So, two, three steps back, I began to do Mira completely. I stopped doing shows, I stopped taking my bookings like I want, and I began to go to Mira, Timbo Nato. Back to square one. Yeah, back to the basics. Um, and you start seeing Patemi actually would value what we're talking about earlier. Yeah. Okay. Because everyone would come to me and say, Moon they're gonna to pay and I on this year. Yeah. Those ah, Dave. Ah, Brian, cool. Ah, Brian. <laughs> you know what? It's funny you say that. Um I saw you at Pikicha yeah. last year. Um, Kuda Rice EP launch, I think. Yeah. You were there? Yeah. I but I didn't know. Like, I, I was like, man, I swear this is Brian K, but is yeah. it Brian K? Yeah. I swear this is Brian. Is it? Yeah. I was just in that state because she got like, because in the case of early, like, uh, before when I was a Tanga Network and whatnot. Yeah. In the case of over, like midway through the launch. Yeah. But I was like, man, I swear that was Brian K. But like you're saying, because the last time I had seen you was in uh, 2018, you were performing in Yanga, I was there. Yeah. And you had locks and so I was just like, I don't know, man. Maybe you yeah. saw him. Yeah. <laughs> you know, it was bigger. Right. Much when I came, yeah. I, I had Much trimmed down. And so, but you get people come come up to, to me and say, Things like ah, ah, but undara, I just use ah, my own way to get 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 my own way to yeah. As I am, Dingori Pond, Yini, Dripanab. Murufana who won a value in what is coming out of me instead of Jinjiru Kunze. Yeah. For a lot of people, to not other paying up was to want a Jinjiru Kunze, machine, 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 but Pichel Bano, Vramka, no Magaj Taura, a panachin, Jinjiru, whatever, Bob. So, when we're thinking now about Beru. Running was louder. Yeah. Running one on Utwani. So, yeah. The Gatron has got him. Reset. to Nasotanga Vasha. And that's when I started doing the um, gospel album. Yeah. Um, and it was done last year, actually. Yaga Pera. I was supposed to release it in October yeah. last year. Oh. And then, again, same moon. Nagashiga but because album is after number it and one Okay, fair enough. Right? Yeah. yeah. Which now looking back, I don't really care. It shouldn't have mattered. Right? Even now someone can say that. Yeah. People can say what they want. Yeah. It shouldn't matter. Why I made that music was it's music I made for myself. I would listen to it, could some songs, right, would even come down. I wake up with the talk codes, ne song, kito yimba, to be in the studio, record it, and I, I, it's music that I felt could okay, more I don't want to do music for myself, for me to be able to go through this 
phase and through and that thing. And you know, I really think it's music that a lot of people need. We've got Ajaga Wandisa. But people are going through a lot. Right? So, Panyaya Purpose, bye bye. Ne calling, bye bye. I really feel good. I guess what has I guess what has been to make the world a better place. Yeah. So, that's what this album is about. The one that's coming. I love that, man. Does, does it have a title? What's the title? It's called As I Am. As I Am. Yeah. Yeah. I, can't, I can't wait to listen to that. And and it's coming out. Well, this comes out like much later. Today is like the 20th of March. Yeah. When does the album come out? It's supposed to come out in April. April? Yeah. This probably comes out in April. Probably yeah. comes out the week of the album. Yeah. So <laughs> We'll stay in touch. <laughs> we'll try and time that. Yeah. Like, but like you'll have the album before it comes out. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Let's do that, man. Yeah. Let's, we'd love that. We'd yeah. love that. We'd really love that. And so... Um, I think that's like a a brilliant place to end. Um, yeah, I think that's a brilliant place to yeah. end. So that we press pause, we we cut the camera, and people go listen to the album. Yep, <laughs> yep. I think <laughs> <laughs> nothing left to say. Oh. <laughs> Thanks so much for coming through. Thank you for having me, man. It was it was brilliant, man. Um, all the best for the rest of the year as well. 